Hello, in this video we will show how we can calculate the porosity of an ideal system and draw a major conclusion. For this case, let us consider a cubic packing of spheres and look at a cube section as shown here. The length of the cube is 2r, where r is the radius of the sphere. Then, the bulk volume of the cube will be 8r cubed. The matrix volume in this case is presented by the volume of the spherical portions in this cubic segment. We have 8 portions of 1 8 of a sphere in this cube. Therefore, the matrix volume is 8 times 1 8 of a sphere and that will be 1 sphere. The volume of 1 sphere is 4 over 3 pi r cubed. The porosity then becomes the bulk volume minus the matrix volume all divided by the bulk volume. And the answer for this case is 0.476 or 47.6%. We can conclude that the grain size does not affect the porosity of the rock, as all the radii in the equation cancel out. In other words, having large spheres or small spheres will lead to the same porosity as long as they are of the same size and of the same packing. For more information, check out my textbook and booklet on reservoir rock properties along with my lecture notes, all provided in the description box down below. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.